Well, what a da on this another first day of a working week. When I was a young Christian, we often used to sing Wade Robinson's old hymn, Loved with Everlasting Love. For some reason, we don't tend to sing this hymn these days, and uh, uh, it's neither found in most of the uh, newer hymn books. However, it's a beautiful and encouraging hymn. And I'd like to read this hymn to you this morning and highlight a few thoughts from it. Robinson said, Loved with everlasting love, led by grace that love to know, spirit breathing from above, thou hast taught me it is so. O oh, this full and perfect peace, O oh, this transport all divine, in a love which cannot cease, I am his and he is mine. Heaven above is softer blue, earth around is sweeter green. Something lives in every hill Christless eyes have never seen. Birds with gladder song o'erflow, flowers with deeper beauty shines. Since I know, as now I know, I am his and he is mine. Things that things that once were wild alarms cannot now disturb my rest. Closed in everlasting arms, pillowed on the loving breast, or to lie forever here, doubt and care and self resign, while he whispers in my ear, I am his and he is mine, his forever only his. Who the Lord and me shall part? Ah, with what a rest of bliss Christ can fill the loving heart. Heaven and earth may fade and flee, firstborn light in gloom decline, but while God and I shall be, I am his and he is mine. Wade Robinson had, has discovered the love of God for himself. It was something personal. And this discovery was life-changing for him. In discovery of the love of God, he found that God's love for him was everlasting. It had no beginning and no end. In a love which cannot cease, I am his and he is mine. Not that for Robinson, discovering the love of God as an everlasting love had completely transformed his life and even his whole outlook upon life. The transformation is so staggering that he confesses that after making such a discovery, heaven above is softer blue, earth around is sweeter green, Something lives in every hue, Christless eyes have never seen. Birds, he says, with gladder songs or flow. Flowers with deeper beauty shines. Discovering this love has even transformed the way that he saw nature. For him, knowing Christ made life worth living. The now for him was brighter as well as a glorious future hope. And can I say on this Monday morning, knowing Jesus is truly life transforming. Gloom is lifted. An array of sunshine lights up our lives. Furthermore, in discovering the everlasting love of Christ, he finds therein a peace that passes all human understanding. Calm and not chaos is the order of the day. Listen to his confession. Things that once were wild alarm cannot now disturb my rest. Closed in everlasting arms, pillowed on the loving breast. Friends, in the love of Christ, Robinson finds security and care. No need to fret anymore 
because whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. He will cover you with his feathers and under his wings you will find refuge. Robinson's God this morning is our God and therefore there is no need for us to fret either because we can find the same security in his everlasting love. And finally, Robinson knew that he knew that nothing could separate him from that love. His forever, only his, who the Lord and me shall part. Ah, with what a rest of bliss Christ can fill the loving heart. Heaven and earth may fade and flee, firstborn light in gloom decline, but while God and I shall be, I am his and he his mine. Friends, what a great discovery he made. Yes, discovering the everlasting love of God in Christ is the greatest discovery that any man and woman can ever make. It's life transforming. Enjoy this rendering of that great old hymn. Poor Bendith, have a great day. Loved with everlasting love, led by grace that love to know, gracious Spirit from above, Thou hast taught me it is so. Perfect peace, or oh, this transport all divine, in a love which cannot cease, I am his and he is mine, in a love which cannot cease. self-resign while he whispers in my ear I am his and he is mine while he whispers in my ear I am his and he can fill the loving heart. Heaven and earth may fade and flee. Firstborn light in gloom decline. But well God and I shall be. Jesus